No Jumper, coolest podcast in the world. I'm in here with my man Remo, and today we're talking to the two of the hottest rappers coming up out of New York City right now. Bloody and Duty Low. Slavar. We outside, man. How you guys doing? Chilling, man, chilling. Ain't so we fresh off a of flight right now. Really? No sleep, Word. none. Wow. But you've been out to LA a few times, you said? Yeah. Uh, yeah. What, what, what do you feel about it, like, in comparison to New York? Yeah, a little slower I don't think no York. other place I've been to is like New York. Oh, oh hell no. Lie. New York? It's crazy. It's fast, bro. Where it's like fast. <laughs> where that's fast. a good explanation. It's New fast. York is faster than a lot of places. Where Especially in the city, as opposed to like being out in Queens or certain parts Queens, of Brooklyn. Queens, Queens to get lit. Queens to get lit Queens, everywhere. Manhattan. In Queens, Manhattan. Bronx. Bronx Brooklyn. Long Island. Staten Island, Yonkers. It get lit. It get lit where? Right. Right, I mean, I lived in some sleepy parts of Queens nah, yeah. back in the day. Yeah, it's, but it's they were always, parts. like, not that far away from some crazy-ass projects. Parts everywhere. Everywhere. Yeah, sleepy parts of Harlem and sleepy go parts Soul, everywhere. Crazy. Yeah, sleepy parts everywhere. Yeah, because y'all from Harlem, so like, that's where y'all, y'all got a poppin' at, right? Mm-hmm. What's it like in Harlem right now, nowadays? And shit, what the rap scene looking like? It's, it's going on, right? Harlem? It's yeah. Harlem? Yeah. But we stepping on it, bro. We're not f***ing with this in Harlem. Harlem. Yeah, it ain't Harlem. Bro, you felt like Harlem was like underrepresented as, as far as the drill shit. Nah, my son Ida, Ida, my son mm-hmm. was one of the that started this shit. Step is, I ain't gonna lie to you, it's that's Lynn Harlem. He ain't said my son a legend for this shit. Yeah, but, but like before the drill scene popped off, Harlem, who was like the last? Dips, saw like this Dips at, at uh, Rocky? Yeah. Yeah. Eastside Pizza. Eastside Pizza. Eastside Pizza. Who else? Mad people. Neek Bucks. Um, babies, it's mad right. from Harlem. Yeah, mad people. That's a fact. But it took them a while to catch up with the drill wave, right? Or at least for rappers to really pop off. Well, I, I, uh, I guess Harlem drill rap. Nah, it wasn't that many Harlem's. Like, yeah, like three Harlem drill rappers. Word. Nah, word. So you, eat out. My son, feel me? Hit a hundred k views. <laughs> After that, it was like, nah, what? For me, that was a lot. Then my son just kept going up. So I hit a million. Be like, nah, that's crazy. Then the Bronx was drinking for me. So, and after that shit got lit, word, then all of us just start rapping. And then all of us just start getting lit. So he got really cracked off the Harlem scene of it. Word. I used to see y'all in the videos for him for yeah, sure. Gangster. Word too. Yeah, my son died really. Is a, is a vet for that word. That's a fact. So when did, how long have you guys actually known each other? Since... Elementary. Elementary. What grade? What, what, what? I was in like second. He was in like third, fourth. Uh huh. And uh-huh. how'd you guys start hanging out? We just badass kids. Gangsta. My son so used to be badass, badass, bull badass kids turning around with friends. Us. Oh yeah, and we was on football team together too. Gangsta. Mm-hmm. Football team. Feel me? And my pops used to come pick That's us up right. from school. Bring it to the block. Used to come something. to the block. All right. Come to my crib, spend the night. Uh-huh. We just always been close ever since. Right. And did you guys kind of get into the street shit at the same time, or? Uh, yeah. Now, nah, but when I stopped playing, when he stopped playing sports, I was still playing sports. Uh huh. For me, he he was for me. Once I stopped playing football, I was playing ball and shit still. Then for me, but when shit got real, hit the fan, we hit the uh, we was together though for sure. That's a fact. So sure. why'd you stop playing sports? You were uh, just want to smoke Zaza and hang out with some ladies. You heard him move. Hold on. You said, you said, you said, I stopped. I stopped I, why, why'd you stop playing sports? Who I, mean, I stopped first. playing, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I, f- I think I hurt, like, I fucked up my leg. So it was clipped up. And plus, COVID, stopped going to school and shit, so. And COVID was really, that shit shifted. Bro, that shit shifted the whole New York. I heard about it. Just outside. COVID shifted. Yo, during COVID, bro, it was this one, it was like a week straight. This was looting, bro. Downtown, <laughs> like, it was riots. Like, that shit was crazy. Real shit, nigga. Downtown going to stores, coming out with everything, eh? I'll be sitting there looking at Twitter all day, just watching crazy new riot footage pop off all yeah, day bro. in so many different cities all over the country. Yeah, bro, sh- crazy, bro. You guys bro. were getting in on that? Nah, I ain't gonna lie. Come there. on. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. This is down there for sure. For sure. I knew people who uh, got in like in shootouts with seeing their ops looting. Shit crazy. Nah, bro. yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Looting was lit. It was Lou and, and um really brought the people and, um, together at the same time. So, no word. It's tough it, to do both though. 
no, they were protesting and looting at the same really? time. Really? Just go back and forth? It's like, uh, it's, like it's, 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 it's all one. And then it ends off as looting. Holy shit. What's crazy. the main thing? It was looting, though. I know in the every, pharmacy. Every, clothes, pharmacy, clothes, clothes, TVs. TVs yeah. Everything, everything you could bro. think of, bro. Store. Every store downtown was getting looted, bro. They went pharmacy. It got crazy. so bad. Started barricading these stores. Man. Gangsta juice. Like, they wasn't even barricade. opening, bro. Like I closed my store like two months before that. Shit. Bro, I remember like it was a the time in COVID <laughs> when the cops were stopping <laughs> for being outside, bro. What? Mm. For real, they bro. was they fake was on some scary shit on COVID. Yeah, it changed everything. That's a fact. But okay, so at what age did you guys start rapping? Uh huh. I started uh, rapping. Like, what age did we make a rap? Or what age did we start and then dropping when, music? Yeah, and then when did you start taking it serious? What wow. age I made a rap? I was like... Oh, no, I think I made a rap when I was a little kid, but yeah. I started taking it serious like a year ago. Yeah, I started taking it serious. Like, like last year? year like, nah, I, started, I started taking it serious in 2022, summertime when my man's died. Where That's what made you want to rap? Yeah, my son Naughty. Yeah, Naughty? Yeah, my son died. He's made a... I forgot how... A tribute song to him. Made a tribute song to him. That was my first song I ever dropped. That shit mill. After that, I just kept going. At first, for me, I had to find my cry for me. This was for me. Then after, like, <laughs> it got to like, once it got to like, I made a song called EBK. After that, I just went on a run. So you're saying you were kind of whack at first and you had to get it together? Yeah, I go, now, I don't think I was whack, but for me, I was saying I wasn't as good as I thought I was. Mm. But now, it's be jacking my Wait, right. your first song did a million views. Yeah, that's first crazy. Song. It was, it was, uh, it was. Um, who posted it? My son died. Nah, I mean, it was died. It was D, all of us. All of them. Yeah, yeah, all of us. Oh, let's go. Everybody on that track. Where shit, I'm That's what's insane about New York and the drill shit is that it seems like somebody can drop a song, and if they're like known in neighborhoods and shit like that, that they can get a million views, like just from people who really are like interested in what's going on in the streets and. Shit. So it like, doesn't even surprise me that much to hear that you got a million views since you were talking about something that everybody was talking about in terms of That's a fact. him losing his life. A New fact. York is mad. Controversy, bro. Yeah, and there's a lot of people. Or, a lot of people in New York. So like street shit really made you start rapping, though. Like, it's yeah, more for like... It were, like, for me. I ain't gonna lie. You just, rapping. for me, that shit is like... It's like, it's like meditation, bro. Like, it's like... Like, when, you, when I'm in the pool for Bro, like it's like, how could I say this? It's like I'm having a counseling session type, therapy, like huh? a therapy word. Yeah, like yeah. I'm just venting my yeah, feelings, off your chest. telling mm -hmm. them what happens in my life every day for me. Word, yeah, but everybody that's drill rapping, don't be telling them. them. Yeah, niggas be talking about other life for real. Supposed to be talking about the streets, so but nah, that's a much appearance in the streets. Yo, but what I was about to say, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I made a song like a month ago or two. I was making a song. I started crying, gang. Yeah. No, <laughs> no, bro. I'm dead ass. What were you thinking crying. about? Started crying. I think made a song like about like my life, today, like the old days, everything for me. Mm. My dad started crying, gang. No, bro. That's that's good to hear because a lot of rappers, like drill rappers, have like one emotion and they don't really ever yeah, like drill, branch off from that. Do not be getting vulnerable. No. How you going to drill rap and get vulnerable, though? I mean, Dirk did it, but he's he's the GOAT. Yeah, that's nah, right. Nah, he he drill rap, and then he did songs. He's mm -hmm. one of them, I ain't gonna lie. That's, that's different, though. What you ain't rapping vulnerable? I ain't gonna lie, that got me through a lot of... A lot of... Really? Nights, bro, I ain't gonna lie. Dirk, I ain't gonna lie. He I took know, he took that shit. I ain't gonna lie. He really be talking for the trenches, bro. I ain't gonna lie. He be saying shit that really be living in. No mm. So y'all like the Chicago drill wave... And we fucked the old block is word too. We was just with the Masa shoebox. Yeah. Can't see all the guys out there were. That's the guy. But you know, there's a uh, OTF duty look. Yeah, facts. <laughs> I'll I be chopping it with him. That's my yeah, yeah. I got his number word too. Picture? Yeah, we took a flick, had a show together. You got a song coming too, word. For real? That's crazy. I was wondering if, if you guys were cool with each other, like how that ended up happening. No word. He got a shiny ass head. Ha, <laughs> that's my boy though. He called me. He's, 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 Why are you still looking at my head though? When he no, said I thought he said you got a shiny. No, 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 no. Been... you got. I mean, that's a lot of work to keep your head Why shiny you as fuck. His... I had to get a, a hair transplant. When you get older, you might have to do this too. What's a hair transplant? Oh, so you you go to Turkey and they take 
the hairs one by one from the back of your head and they move them to the front of your head so that your hairline will be all filled in. And believe it or not, like LeBron James got this, Tory Lanez got this, like all kinds of rappers oh, and that's shit. Oh, LeBron did to fix his Yeah. I don't uh, think it work like that, though. Well. It's not LeBron's. <laughs> <laughs> different types of hair, but we'll see. So it's going to grow? Yeah. It's, uh, but people like expect it to be long and like luxurious already, but it's like it's gonna be like six months or like eight months before it starts to like look good. So they they gotta wait. <laughs> Old head. <laughs> this is unk. You guys are in your joint era. I don't know if you use the slang in, a in New York. A joint is like a young, flashy, hot, young, chick. icy dude who's yeah, like out. I mean, yeah, you said chick. What the. F you nah, refer to joint, females like, as yeah. joint, like, yeah, 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 joint's like, yeah. a girl. Uh, <laughs> a joint's a girl. Nah, like, it's you guys joint. are joints right now because you just came out, nah, you're popping, you're no doing joint. your thing. Being a joint you don't want to a joint? We make uh, joint sons, They you smoke gotta, joints. Not, yeah, we smoke yeah, joints. That's a problem. This is a joint. Yeah. Oh, for real? Nah, the ladies is the joints. Yeah, yeah. the joints. Ladies. It's LA. But then also, like, you and Unk. I see you're an old head. So it's like, between, like, you could be a joint when you're, like, 18, 16, whatever. You become an unk more like late thirties, mid thirties type shit. But some people become unks early. <laughs> I think I'm. A, I think I'm. A I'm fighting unk. against it. I, gonna lie, yeah, I might be an early unk. Yeah, early unk school. I ain't gonna lie school. You're an early unk. Yeah, because be you guys unk. got all the sixteen year old shooters around you and shit, right? What are you talking yeah. about? Bro? Nah. Nah. I mean, that'll make you feel like an unk. Nah, yeah. It's real life. New York make you grow up fast, though. Like we, we the general bees. Yeah, a lot. We the generals. Shit though, you do got um, gotta step have up steppers you. behind you. Mm -hmm. you gotta step but up. But you gotta too, take care of your niggas, bro. If you don't take care of your niggas, bro. If you don't take care of your niggas, bro. See that they gonna crash out, or they just gonna nah. Put you, the menu, gonna put you on the menu. That's a fact. Or they gonna turn into No Limit Cairo and go do an interview and talk about you, air nah, all your that's, shit. That's, Nah. <laughs> nah, it depends, bro. Shout out Cairo. He's a good dude, though. But Y'all believe all the shit he's saying is true? Like, everything? <sighs> That's a good question. I mean, yeah, pretty much. Because I don't feel like he really, like, jumped out the window that crazy. He was, like, expecting things. So you I, feel like G Herbo not a real shit? No, I, I fuck with G Herbo, but I also <laughs> feel like G Herbo's just, like, a selfish dude. Like, most people are like that. Like he, You feel like he's selfish? He got on, and like all his home, like his homies, like a lot of times when you're first starting to get money, you think like you're gonna be able to do so much for all your homies, make broken promises. But then when it actually you start getting into your career and you start paying taxes and you start like you're not on year one, you're on year three, and you're like looking at how much money you're making, and you're like, well, shit, I can't really do that much for for you, and then it's just kind of like that. But like most people stay quiet about that because they want to stay cool with the rapper. Cairo's like the rare dude who's like, whatever, I'm unhappy, I'm gonna air it out. Though. But I'm like, happy I'm in it out too. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Mm. I'm not holding down my fence, bro. Be tucking on the steppers. I'm not jacking out. Gangster. Tucking on the steppers? Tucking. Tucking on the steppers. Can you break that down for me? <laughs> like, be holding out on the guys. Like, okay. gangster. Be leaving I'm the guys with that. Give bitch. everything, but yeah. like, gang, if you're gonna get a hundred or a million, whatever, you know you gotta break down with the that you've been with. Mm. Cause they go take right. care of you. Hit the fed. That's what you go look to for shit to go on for me. So you gotta make sure they sturdy too. That's a fact, bro. And that's Cairo's argument is basically like this isn't like a regular rapper entourage. Like you needed us to protect you at a time when you were vulnerable, and now you aren't really in those situations as much, or you're with security or you're whatever. So it's like to him, he feels like that's fake, and I understand where he's coming from. Uh, yeah, that's why I be telling my friends, bro. I ain't feel about no felonies, bro. Get you a security license, bro, so I can pay you. Pay you. you but it's a you. trap. It's a trap being a drill rapper, and it's a trap being a young teenager in New York who's involved with street shit at all in general because you either got to keep this shit on you or if you got to just you could go get a target. security license, and you could get your gun license, and you could be getting paid for real. Yeah. But you can go get your security license, and then you can just post up in the projects and just smoke weed and just hang out, but you got a gun on you and you just, you're like, I do security, exactly. even though I'm not doing that right now. I mean, oh, do the cops good, have their guns on them when they, oh, well, it's not they? really like a protection thing with us, like, feel me? Cause we, this own, is real life, bro. Yeah, they like, protected. Yeah, nah, I ain't gonna lie to us, bro. not really protecting. Bro, you, you got your own shit, this, bro. Everybody's doing it, gang. 
no or it's not really protection game because the we be with it'll be a time we got to protect them too man so it's like it's not the same bro but it's got to really elevate though move around real security and shit. we don't have to put the guys at, at risk for me to yeah. end up in bad situations and shit. Sure. Protect the bag, bro. But you guys are still in this weird, like, transitional period of your career because you just got popping yeah. within, like, the last year. So yeah. are, have you found yourselves in any situations where, like, to us in L.A., <laughs> it's funny because we always see videos of, like, Bronx drill rappers like that who will just be, like, getting into crazy little fights on the street, running after each other and shit. And we're just like, how the does this happen? Like, this is crazy. New Shit. York is a zoo, They got a fight. Y'all got a fight. Yeah. Well, that was cool. the airport, right? That was my son to him. But, mm. yeah, that's wool for real, bro. Nah, it ain't gonna lie, bro. New it's York wool outside, bro. Wool, bro. You could see it anywhere, right bro. There, like, bro. I'm mm. telling you, bro. Like, the least expected place, bro, is there where you be seeing. Be people. sharing the same McDonald's. Like, it'd be two projects. Like, it'd be oh, black, bro. The same project or the same Literally, we got blocks. Project. We got beef with blocks. That's like. Our block is right here, and all we gotta do is walk down the steps, and now we on the Ops block. Or we got a block right here, and all we gotta do is walk down the hill, and now we on the Ops block. So then, how you move when you out there knowing, like, all right, I gotta go to McDonald's, or like. You gotta move, you gotta move correct. Yeah. You gotta move like you're not trying to lose. Word. Word. You wanna move around, you gonna get your head knocked right off. Gangsta, okay, bro. It's that quick, bro. No bull. Mm. So you just did a bid, though. How long, how long you been out now? Man, I've been out for like four yeah, months now. I, I, did, I did a couple <laughs> months now. I did, yeah. I did a couple months, feel me? Yeah. I've been out for four months now. For it. For it. What you was locked up for? For me. Some crazy <laughs> shit, bro. Some, some <laughs> wild <laughs> shit, bro. Crazy Nah, nah, no crazy <laughs> like that, but just, for me, gun charges, shit like that, for me. Word, bad shit like that. So when people say, like, you get an automatic three years or whatever in New York if you get nah, caught with a cap, gun. That's, that's cap. That's, that's how it cap. used to not be. Not like your first go around. Nah, that's cap. Not even about your first go around, bro. Law change, bro. It's mad oh, different yeah. changes in the law. You might get like a mm. city like, bullet. Uh, like, uh, I think like I think before having a gun charge was like a high ass felony. Now, mm. if you just get caught with the gun, but like not using it to harm nobody or something, I think it's like lower now. Or something. Mm. But the first time I bailed out, feel me. Then I got locked up again. Then that's when they fake gave me like a deal for me. Do six months in, two oh, yeah. two and a half years on pro probation for me. Took that sturdy. Mm -hmm. In yeah. New York, bro, if you like all nonviolent crimes, you don't go to jail for them. Shit. Like you go and get R and R or bail. You there's no way you're going to jail for a nonviolent crime. Okay, so you driving it out, it's going crazy, bro. You know, like. Shit. Be mattering. You was locked up on Rikers? Where they had you at? Shit? Nah, some other shit. Some yeah. like adolescents, like some juvenile type shit. But you was lit when you was in there? Yeah, that yeah, shit. Was how, lit, how was the, what was the experience like? Cause like, right, like you got the I, career going when on? When I first went, I went with my mans. It was me and my son D. For me, like, I went in 2023 20, in January. Yeah, I went in 2023 in January. It was me and my mans. My son D, we came in for me. We see niggas at the window. They like, that's duty low. That's duty low. That's D nigga banging and shit. But shit just funny, like, nah, that shit real. Yeah. I mean, niggas had to focus up. And like a week went past and my man's left, but I, I had to stay. So I stayed like for like a month. Then I bailed out. Feel me where I bailed out. Then in November, in the, then in July, July I got locked up again, bro. Then that's when I sat down for a little bit, came back up. At this time, was you signed and shit, or? No. Nah. Yeah. I was just independent. Right. But you still had the views going and shit. Body. bumping. And my first song when I came home had a mill. It's been lit since. That's crazy. Yeah. So, what's your relationship with uh, Edoc? Because like, that's why I used to see you in the videos. and uh, Edoc, that was my heart right there. I ain't gonna lie. That's blood. Once, once my son died, fake pass, that's when I fixed our take my son serious. died. Gangsta. God. <laughs> my son, my son really Bro, put that light on his head. I ain't gonna lie. He put that light on. Little drill rappers from New York. Nah, no, bro. He gave me a chance, bro. When you say the hill, break it down. It's Sugar Hill, right? Yeah, Sugar Hill. So what, what that mean for people who don't know? Sugar Hill is a, is a, um, is a neighborhood in Harlem, Manhattan. 
It's just our block, bro, our neighborhood where we grew up. It's a big ass strip you don't want to be on at the wrong time. <laughs> that's it. Well, you say that's the coolest project in Manhattan. We don't got a project. That's, that's the, the difference area. between us. We got projects. The we is dumb big. It's not bad and big. It's like, like five, like, six abs. Yeah. 20 blocks. Like 20 blocks, yeah. Nah, not 20 blocks, like 10 blocks, 15 blocks. Yeah, like 10, 15, but like 20, though. Yeah, three abs, though. Three abs. Nah, four abs. Riverside, Broadway, Amsterdam, and Scenic. And then from like 143rd to like 155th. So that's like 12 blocks. Or You said that's when y'all really, when you start taking the music serious. Yeah, that's when I started taking music serious. I ain't gonna lie, I dropped that freestyle. Um, what's that? Um, on the block. Nah, nah, block, block, block work TV. TV yeah. Block work TV. Yeah, word. Block work TV. That was my first song. Yeah, word to we both did one of them shits. Games, I, we all did one of them. Yeah, game. all like of us Fox, were. Me, D, Roscoe, Duty, and my son JB. I got a dad do another one with that nigga because <laughs> me too. I, my shit was the first shit to ever hit a mill on his page. Word to. Yo, I think I gotta do a part two. What's the cool performance-based YouTube channels to hit up in New York at this point? Because a couple years ago it was just like on the radar, and now it feels like there's a million. Uh, on the radar, my son, um, KJ shot it. One mic. One mic. Uh, it's mad shit. It's like New York drill be having a freestyle. One New York City sounds like be having a freestyle. Mm -hmm. Mad shit. It's mad underground shit. It's mad but shit. But Blockwork TV from New York. Yeah, Blockwork right? TV. I think he is. Oh, I'm not sure, but his shit drinking too. Yeah, On the block, man. shit drinking too. It was some shit I did in Jersey too. What was that shit called? The shit we did in Jersey, the freestyle. Oh, oh, oh go create clubhouse, right? Nah, the other shit. Not shot by way. That's the car shit. Oh yeah, shot by way. Oh, yeah, shot by way. He got some unique yeah. shit. He got like a like camera set up in the, the car, car. Uh, mm. yeah. where you just make a freestyle in the car while he driving you through your neighborhood or shit. That's okay, fine. I did like two of those. You feel like people <laughs> really be getting on from that shit? Yeah, that shit. Yeah, I, I feel like I ain't, if you don't got a YouTube page or a, a platform, like <coughs> for me, I first dropped on on one of those platforms, like a freestyle platform. Then I dropped on my son page, on his page. So, all right. But if you don't got now, word like to he dropped on, drop on he dropped on my page. He dropped pages. on my page, and I dropped the song before that, like four days before that. And he dropped the song. And his shit fake past mine in like a day or two. I'm like, nah, you gotta go crazy, bro. That's like that was his second song. I'm like, nah, you gotta gotta make your YouTube right now, bro. You gonna go up, bro. What was the Tell first me. song? My first song was Bestie. Yeah, word that shows pain. Uh, was pain. No bullshit. Definitely. And when he made um. Aha, uh -huh. yeah, aha, uh -huh. uh -huh, nah. that was pain. Those two songs is different. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, then when he made that, my favorite song by him is Bloody Flow. Though that's my, that's my shit. I was listening to that one last night. I fought with that. Yeah, that's you just shit. dropped. I get it in too, right? Like yeah. a couple days ago. That shit uh, hard yeah. too. Yeah, I dropped that video and I dropped the freestyle of that too. So, oh y'all go tune in. How y'all be uh picking the beats and shit? Like y'all, y'all got producers. Y'all just I ain't gonna lie. Every all my recent songs like. The producer it cook it up, it up at the, the stool, like on the spot. Like I just tell him, like I, ain't gonna lie, I, be going I probably YouTube, like bro. say like two lines, and he just play like a loop, and then start pulling the beat while he hear me rock for me to how it sounds good to the song and shit. My son Hardhead, Lucas, Eli, those are my boys. Bro, wait, we we didn't get into the meanings behind your names. Where where your names actually come from? My, I, my name. Niggas be thinking our dad got my name from the Chicago Duty Low. Because also Vaughn made it so famous by just saying me and Duty yeah. Low. Like so I I almost can't even see Duty Low without thinking about it like that. Uh-huh. No, nah, I don't know, but that's not what I, I it fit, Not uh, here in New York. It was like for me, when I was a kid, when I was like a baby, my mom always called me Duty. Like mm. so like my friends, like my family, family friends, everybody called me Duty growing up. Mm. So for me. After that, the pros was like, duty. And then you see how Vaughn just was like, it's just me and duty low. And niggas just started calling me duty low. Mm. Then after that, for me, just, that was my name. It's like how there'll always be a fat dude and people start calling him Biggie. <laughs> <laughs> Biggie, I'm no, crying. Fat niggas be having a name like, like Smalls. Like Biggie, Chubbs. <laughs> fat nigga named Small, Smalls. nigga mad, big nigga named Smalls. <laughs> Funny shit like that. <laughs> Gangster. For sure. Um, okay, so like who who was rapping locally that you guys were looking at as influences when you were first getting started though? Oh wait, and I forget, we gotta do your name too though. We gotta do your name. 
No, I got my name on some regular shit, like, for me. Me and my pops got the same name. So we just got the same nickname. Like, right. Yeah, and so, right. and this is mind-blowing, but so they introduced me to your dad out there and said your dad actually does porn. <laughs> yeah, he do um, OnlyFans and shit. Oh, yeah. oh, so he's not like a regular <laughs> porn star? He like, just started hey. doing it on his own? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. He got, like, full face tattoos and shit, too. So did he, like, kind of try to keep you away from the streets, or did he just say, like, I, like it's going to happen either I way? Like, I grew up with my pops and my grandma and shit like that, but, like, I grew up with my grandma OD because my pops and my mom's, they got booked, so, for me. So they're both grew, locked up? Yeah. Damn. I grew, I grew up with just my grandma and shit like that. Word. But now you and him are tighter? Yeah. Or. I be, you know what it is? I like after my grandmother died and shit. So for me, that's when I really was like more outside. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So after that, I just started chilling with my pops. Od came home, spent with him and shit. But people are always telling me that like my kid is gonna be fucked because I do porn. <laughs> but you seem like you're fine. Hell yeah. So, nigga said, but you seem like you're fine. <laughs> yeah. I mean, besides the drill rapper gang member thing, you know what I mean? No, wait, why, to why me, not, that's wait, why they say your kid, wait, what, you have bro. a daughter or something? Like a daughter. She's three. So oh, wait, yeah, why daughter? they say she's going to be fucked? I mean, people are always like, you know, they're gonna, she's going to find out or she's going to get made fun of in school or whatever. It's not you. Man, that's mom. not you bad. Like, big deal. I'm lit. Shit. Yeah, yeah, you lit. Yeah, yeah you are. You pops supposed to be taking shit down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mom not supposed to be getting taken down. Well, It's like technicality there. Dude, you're basically you're basically doing what everyone else in the world is every other parent is doing, but you're just showcasing it. That's what I know. Oh, man, but that it. does make every other parent look at you a little weird. Weird, I know. As yeah. like, oh, you're doing it on camera. But so it wouldn't a be a lot weird of people aren't even fucking. So it wouldn't be, like, be weird if you don't have a kid. So that's just bias, bro. That's I know. Bias. If I didn't have kids, I don't know what they would say. Yeah, All it. they ever say is like, you have kids. Well, you I'm like, I don't give a fuck. When you pick your kids yeah, up, they, they they be looking at you funny like. Wait, that's your only kid? Yeah. We don't know yet. We're going to yeah, we gonna see. We're going to check in in like five years, six <laughs> years. <laughs> but I also feel like it would be easier for a boy to deal with it than a girl. Yeah, that's, that's a, a fact. Boy. That's a fact. You know? A boy, he going to be like, yeah, my dad a porn star. He fuck wow. Yeah. A girl, yeah. she going to be probably like shy about it. But my kid is also going to be able to deflect and be like, nah, my dad be with the rappers and shit, shit. So shit. Yeah. <laughs> you know. Yeah. Cool points. My dad head. is like, lit. Yes, he is on camera with a boner, but he also... Be with the rappers. Yeah. Not at the same time. Nigga said, oh, camera with the boner. <laughs> <laughs> I heard boner. Wow. Boner? You don't know say boner? What you say, say, what you say a hard arm? You say no, boner. <laughs> stiffy. I got a boner. I got a stiffy. A stiffy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> nigga said wild. Right, right, right. Right. The blicky with the stiffy. <laughs> nah, nah, you wild. You wild. Nah, you know what I was thinking about before? He said, not the blicky. He said, blicky. You know what I was thinking about before, though? Is that when 6 9 was first coming up, he was so thirsty to do an interview with me, like hit me up nonstop, like desperate as fuck. And now, but, but at the time there wasn't any like real lit, like underground rap platforms in New York. Now there's a million fucking places that would have been happy to do an interview with him. You know, like you wasn't but, jacking it, right? I wasn't fucking wait, with him at first. It took you, a while. Wait, he wanted you to do the interview what, after he was around or before he was around? Before. No, this is way before. This is when he had like 20,000 uh, so followers. So he wasn't jacking him? Oh, the, I thought he was annoying as fuck. He was, he, he just was, kept hanging. He was weird. Shit? But like hey, he kept hitting me up. But then he did the song with Trippy, and then I was like, all right, I see the vision. <laughs> did the interview, but I never really seen him after that. He gonna violate you, bro. You see this, bro? What's he gonna do? I mean, you talked about shit. him a million times. Were you scared of six nine? <laughs> Who? Let's talk about it. Y'all follow six nine? You are. Bravo. Stop Bloody versus six nine. Man. What the fuck? Bro, you saw what the niggas did to him inside that um oh, that yeah. gym. That Free was mall, crazy. Brother. Like, why would he go to a gym though? Like, just <laughs> he was doing mad cardio. Academics said that his whole thing is like when he's ready to put a song out, he'll be in the gym hours and hours and hours a day trying to get skinny because he thinks he needs to be super skinny to drop music. You mean, what do you mean to shoot a video? He has to be yeah, skinny? like to to drop <laughs> to drop new music and shoot a video. He's got to be like in really good shape because I guess he'd be getting fat like when he stops releasing music for a while. So academics said that he will go to this gym 
and be doing cardio for like four or five hours, which to me is even crazier because you're just a sitting duck. Uh-huh. You all exhausted and tired and soaking wet and shit. Like, <laughs> Dolo. they just run down on you. Yeah, What's wrong with you? Nigga trolling. Especially crazy, after, right? like, him, a nigga like him. Nah, you wild. So y'all was never nigga, fucking with him? 40. Like, because at one point, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Come the whole on. Was, yeah, I was listening to his show yeah, for sure. I was listening to his show after he was a rap, but I wasn't jacking. <laughs> after? After, after, after he was a rap? Nah, like, one, two. Just to check it out, right? I wanted to tape his shit up and listen to it, but of course shit was playing, nigga still was hearing six nine songs. Bro, word to that, it was a point when that nigga was a rat. He was breaking YouTube game. Uh, song the Nicki Minaj song and like the, the other off. song right before. Yeah, it was, it was, was, was kind of lit for like a moment. Yeah, a moment, but right now. Yeah. I haven't heard a song from 6 9 in probably think, like a year. I think he's just doing reggaeton shit now. He, wait, what's wrong with him? He's man? doing Latin music got? and shit. <laughs> what I think I say, he said reggaeton. I think he stays what the fuck in the, is reggaeton. Because he got arrested in the Dominican Republic, I think. What's reggaeton? Nah, reggaeton is, is like Latin like, music yo, that and shit. Got wild man, confidence. Bad money, like, all that. He bullshit. really don't nigga care that he's a rap, bro. Like, he really on. don't care. Like, I think he does care. He gets nah, really he upset when anyone care. mentions it, right? What he really say, nigga? Well, yeah, he put a rat. rat on his head. Yeah, right. like he don't care, bro. You homies with any rats? Huh? What? What? <laughs> what? Stop it, Stop bro. it, bro. Well, I mean... A lot of people are. Nah, let's be real. No, a lot of people rats. don't like just yeah, cut the rats them off. The belt. No, yeah, really? no nigga is be real. Last nigga that I ride it, that nigga got. We can't even tell you what happened to him. Oh shit! <laughs> demon, yeah, so got a demon at the table. <laughs> All right. Duty low, you scared. What's the guy with them gang ties on, bro? What's up, what's up with that? I was trying to ace it, nigga. You an ass. <laughs> Why you made that freeze? Nigga said, nigga said, I'm bloody nigga. Said. <laughs> <laughs> Where's my super suit fit? <laughs> what, what do you think I should do if I go to jail? Should I be a white guy or should I roll with the Hispanics? Or, should, roll, or should I be an honorary with, black guy? You should roll with the MS 13. Nigga said, honorary yeah. black guy. Nah, MS 13. You gotta go with them. You gotta shave all your hair off, put more tattoos. You might be an honorary black guy. You gotta put more tattoos on here. You might be a But you're not going to jail. You're not going to jail. I don't think I'm gonna last long as a crip. <laughs> crip? You don't think you could be a crip? Five, five, you don't jack five. that crip shit? I just, it's too, it's too messy. It's too you messy. Blood, yeah, right? it's too, too much blood. 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 Keep it a buck. Nah. You guys don't fuck with that? You be Muslim? New York don't do blood, that anymore? Right? You New York still got blood. You'll be Muslim? You'll be blood, huh? Hell no. You wanna be Muslim? No. I'm telling you, Muslims hold weight in a jail's game. We just had a rapper on here going off saying that you pussy if you become a Muslim in jail. <laughs> yeah, nah, yeah, that's that's for protect that niggas daddy turned a Muslim in jail for protection nah, 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 or two. Nah, 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 nah. That's like a Bro. that's like a separate some game. Some niggas be doing some niggas be doing you say you say niggas is rats? Rats turn Muslim? The Muslims will have you. I don't know Chad. what you talking about. <laughs> I ain't never heard that niggas that's Muslim that is fishing with jail. Yeah, right. That's what Some I niggas dead turn terms, like the lifers Muslim. and shit. Niggas dead be turning Muslim to fun for me. Word, like niggas be need, they be reading and shit. Shit be niggas making them fuck out. I ain't gonna lie, I dead be thinking about turning Muslim sometimes. Really? <laughs> One too. Do you gonna think you need to like? They're gonna make it huh? yeah. Do you need to stop Never. being a drill rapper Gangsta? to become no, Muslim, you or you gonna do both? Yeah, you try. Like Tay Savage. Huh? You, are you gonna <laughs> Are you gonna stop gangbanging and rapping about it, and then become Muslim, or are you gonna just do both at once? If I become a Muslim, I'm be on my own. Oh, yeah. shit, bro. You gonna heavy, be a revolutionary? Heavy revolutionary, bro. I feel like you could change the world. Are you, you put on a suit? Shit. You start talking about peace and shit. It's over. I'll be on my Christian shit, bro. I'll be just chilling. Right. Okay. You a Christian now? You religious now? No, I believe in God though. Yeah. Or I'll be talking to God. That's a fact. Or What's he saying? Huh? He what's he, what's he, he, he telling me don't crash, just keep going, folks. Keep mm-hmm. going, folks. Don't crash. Be grateful. You heard, bro? No bullshit, bro. You, you feel like you about to crash, crash out sometimes though? Like with huh? all, the, all the diss songs and shit niggas be doing. <laughs> Nah, I don't know, bro. Nah, it's real just, life, bro. It should be really happening, bro. Word, Fuck bro. this song, bro. Yeah. You don't really see a nigga. <laughs> they really might have to do something to somebody. For somebody to do something to you. Extra. No bullshit, bro. <laughs> Talk about uh, this song. That's... Yo, let me see that blood, fool. Word. Are you, all right, because, like, y'all had ran into the gen in the uh, airport. Chen, Chen, Chen. <laughs> Niggas Light so it up. Jen, niggas out, bro. Bro gave him the belt. You wasn't there. Bro, let me tell you. They're not in the streets, bro. We got him. When I got on the flight, I got on the flight going to Jersey. Him and bro got on the flight going to New York. You heard? So when I'm on a plane, I look at my phone. See, please don't lie. They posting the fight. 
I text, I text his manager like, yo, bloody in a fight. We out, we off the plane. You know, his manager going to text me. I already got off the plane. I just ain't want to tell you because I know you would have been bugging, bro. And, and it's going to be too much. I'll, I'll just go, just go. I'm going to make sure they sturdy. I'm like, nah, this nigga weird, bro. Nigga left me, bro. <laughs> I'm tight. And then the day that I left, bro, these niggas had the littest day, bro. Or it too, bro. We went stew with sexy back. red and shit. Every girls. Sexy. I'm like, nah, y'all niggas Ooh, it was crazy, bro. I'm like, watching on my phone. It was I'm like, damn, bro. I wasn't even there, bro. Sexy red was fucking with was you? was in Miami. She knew where you... You this nigga love sexy red. Sex, bro. Oh, her house. She love her. What she said? She called you cool. Tell her. Yeah, I she called you cool. Tell her. As soon as we came out, I got a lot. I was on some drunk shit. I got a lot. What she said? That's cool. I pulled up. I got a lot. Nah, I like you. I need a picture. I'm like, nah, you pretty. She's like, yeah, you handsome. I'll be talking and shit. And for me. Yeah. Like, oh. You really fuck with her or you just doing nah. it for the clout? What you mean? Nigga, what you mean for the club? What club? I don't even be. Yeah, he yeah, don't, don't know her. If like you that. wipe nah, he her up, she attractive. And you yeah, trot nah, her I around your neighborhood like look. she's Murder B or some shit, no. then you're gonna be lit. What? what? Bro? You can't trot around Murder B. Murder B is no, sexy fuck with red it. is two different equations. You man. think? Listen, yeah, bro. Nah, she like Murder B like that for New York. I bet. No, would you do a porno with sexy? Let's get into that. Niggas don't look at Murder B. I complete the mission. Whatever the mission is, I'm doing it. I complete the mission. What, bro? The mission gets like, completed. Hey, fuck shit. this shit out Wait, you, what you said? Wait, what he said? Wait, what you asked him, though? I said, I said, would you do a porno with Sexy? Sexy be oh, talking yeah. like she would fuck this shit. He That's said, why I, oh, I yeah. jack her like. Oh, he yeah. She oh, be yeah. talking like, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I know she a demon. I'm sure bro. what this pink dick do, because she said she don't want it. You asked See, her? Yo, you a troll, bro. <laughs> she said she don't fuck with pink dick. You asked said pink, bro. What you mean pink dick? She said she don't fuck with pink dick. She said pink dick. You going live, bro. This nigga is wild. That's a vape. Nigga backed up the pink V. That's what you want, bro. What it is? Oh man. Nah, nigga says different pink. Different pink, I think. Nah, nah, bubba, 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 bubba. He said nah, bubba. Yo, let me see that jail. That's not it. Yo, bubba. So basically. Basically, yeah. So, basically, so you was on a different plane? That's why. Right. Yeah, I was on a different plane. That shit had me fed up, bro. So how this shit cracked off? You just seen him? You like, oh shit. Yo, throw the lighter. Nigga, we was Cross running the towards lighter. the shit. We was running towards the um. We was running towards the what you call it? We um, was running towards the the terminal. We was running towards the terminal so we could get on the plane. I guess they was about to do um. You know what that shit is called? Like when you miss your flight. The. Standby shit. Yeah, standby. Okay. They was on standby, and they standby was off flight. So they, would, if we and Roscoe didn't make our two seats, they was gonna get on our two seats. Whoa! How ironic is that? That's insane. You know what I'm saying, right? So, so y'all fought for the seats. They at the desk, like we run into all this shit. They at the desk, and I just see people putting their heads. I'm like, oh, I'm like, you see them, Roscoe? But we just trying to get on a plane. Word to my mother, I just look. It's these damn room niggas, like they like. Not trying to look at niggas that they like they not speaking, they not even looking, but they just head forward and Jenna's like fake walking away. I'm like, I'm like, yo, yo, fake look, I'm like, I thought the own shit. <laughs> I was with some enemies, I thought the own shit, right? I I you already know what that went. I'm like, we gotta get it, we just start fighting this shit. Who cracked on who first? So you threw it up and it just got to the popping? They got threw it up and I popped them. Oh word, right, yeah. Who'd you hit first, Jen? Nah, I don't know. Jen was away, bro. But we start okay. fighting on. Look, I was is Jen on fair Kyle, game? Is what I'm trying to say. Is she Jen fair is, game? She's fair game. Cause she was, she with the guys. Her, so it's like you know. When you see her smack. She's fair game, bro. She don't want to be treated like a chick in any other part of life. So I feel like when it comes to a squabble, she probably right, look, let me get doesn't want to be left out, if, right? If women that pers persuade themselves as a man start to talk about your dead friends and family, mm. and you see them in person. And then you fight one of their male friends and they get to trying to get in. What you going to do? I mean, I'm just trying to imagine myself squaring up with a chick right now. No, I'm talking about you get it on but... one of the male friends and then you oh, see yeah, yeah. Fuck, her, fuck her, like, me up. Yeah, she's trying right. to get in like, bitch, back up. Oh, yeah, for sure that. <laughs> that was bad. Pose. I, mush that before. <laughs> I thought Dude, it was yeah. more than a mush. I got, it was a stomp or something, right? Yeah, yeah. I said I got violent. Stomp, so, stomp, stomp. Knees, stomp. Knees, I heard that while I was in jail. Knees, 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 knees. So the video I that came out. I looked at that shit. When I looked at it, I was in jail. I, I looked at it. Where it's, I'm like, nah, the guy's going up. That shit hit a <laughs> mill while I was in the spot. I'm like, oh, check my son. Ross going bloody out. Wait, so the, how long did it take for the video to come out? Right away? Bro, I don't know. We wait till we got back to New York. Oh, all right. Yeah, word two, while they were shooting a video, 
while they were shooting a video, I was in the um the booth making a song. So I didn't even get to be in the video. I was tight when I saw it. Really? Okay, so nah, I was you was in the video for like tiny bit. But uh is it awkward? Like like okay, so was was it straight up like you guys used to be cool and then they start dissing naughty, so then you're not cool? No, we never knew them. They not, oh, I thought they you not knew them beforehand. I don't think I think like they was college and then they made like a group and then for me, I don't know. They but a like, band, bro. Right, it's but a basi- band, bro. Basically, yeah, look, band. let me tell you. So, <laughs> band, me, bro, it's, it's, a, band, it's a guy, it's some you. nigga from our block. His name Blockwork, right? Shout out Blockwork. So, yeah. We had him on before. Uh huh. So for me, so Blockwork. <laughs> so, so you heard about how Blockwork got vanished and shit? How he just vanished? Like, like he's not allowed to come around anymore. Like, vanished, he could come vanished. around like yeah, vanished. Nah, he didn't even get. He just like ran away type shit <laughs> off the block. Like niggas just told him you can't be here. He really left. Damn. Yeah, like that was some weird shit. But anyways, mm. so when he left, he started being cool with those niggas. And then my little man's naughty that passed away. Right. He made a song like 41K, Y'all Jack and the Snitches. Mm. And then after that, it just. Yeah. Once he died, they dissed him. And once he, he died, they made that, that song. And they did the, yeah, they did the dance, and the dance yeah. blew up, and yeah, I just think got all fucked up. Right. Damn, so it's just been up ever since then. Word. That's what's crazy. The, what's the 401? Huh? What's the four one like? Like y'all uh be? Could you drop four one stomp? Didn't it? Yeah, four one is dub niggas. Yeah, so I stay y'all, after there. y'all got into a fight, y'all drop four one stomp. Uh huh. Yeah. And then they drop stomp stomp. Yeah. And then so y'all shit came out first, right? Yeah. And then they shit kind of went up after the fact. How y'all felt when y'all like damn them niggas? Cause they shit kind of went up on numbers a little bit more than y'all's after the fact, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I ain't really care. I said my shit get it from the streets, bro. Like. I'm really outside. Niggas is getting put in spots by labels and all the extra shit. And niggas that's not really even in the streets, niggas not even in the streets. So that goes to show that people like, people that be getting beat up more, I guess, right? Y'all, y'all got on the plane after that? Nah, I don't know. We went back to the place and that's when we seen Sexy. We seen Mad Rap. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Are you on the no fly list now? Well, I guess you're out here, so you can't be. Come on now. I think I'm no flying, man. Nigga, it's sturdy. Did you get in any kind of trouble for it? You know, the airport, they don't be playing like with shit like that. Nah. You I know a lot, bro. When people fight, bro, it's like, this nigga it's not that big fights, deal. Bro. One time, I was at court. It's not that big deal. Bro. I was at court. This nigga came with me to court. This nigga says, I'm thirsty. I said, bro, we at the courthouse right now, bro. You liable to see anybody going to the store. In the stores, wild falls, no store. He said, he said, bro, I'm thirsty, bro. I'm going, bro. This nigga with me, this nigga right here. Look, look at him. He was sleeping. Nigga sleeping. This nigga goes downstairs. One of the older bros called me. He was in front of the call. I was waiting for us. He called me like, I called, no, I called him because I called bro and he wasn't answering. His phone was dead. So I called one of the older bros like, yo, yo, go, go in the building and see if bloody sturdy. He just came downstairs, but like, he not answering his phone. He called me back like, I don't know where he at, but the cops just broke up a fight. Two niggas just had a fight. I, I, I. I'm like, nah, this nigga, <laughs> bro. I just knew it was him, bro. Then like 10 minutes later, I see the ops post. Yo, we just so bloody, uh, uh. So I'm like, I'm like, yeah, it was him. How'd the fight go? How'd the fight go? It was some weird yeah. shit, man. Who was it? Bro, yeah, bro, look, this yeah, nigga who was see, it? This nigga seen... Two different ops, gang. Like he seen, like, three, he seen, he seen they clicked up right in front of you. Blocks. Two different blocks. Yeah, he seen, he seen two ops from one block. Yeah. And he seen two ops from another block. At the same time, like first he see these niggas, then he turn his head to see these niggas, and they ops of each other too. Oh shit! But they just said, "Fuck it, we not on each other. We on bloody." Niggas like nah. My side the roly on and everything came out with the roly. No, no, nothing on his face. Nothing. They even the op they dead said they said nah, bloody you did your thing for me. Like, you, you held it down. Bloody be giving it up. I be going out. I raised the right. Stop playing <laughs> me, bro. I be going out. Is that your son's son or? That's my blood. <laughs> Who's son, son, bro? My what am I, dad? I mean, do you guys have like a father son type relationship? That's my son, huh? That's, That's your son. My son. Okay. No <laughs> bullshit, bro. Niggas know who used to pick he niggas know. up from school. <laughs> nigga, we was in the same school. That's what I'm saying. I up, said, bro. yo, do you know we out? Yo, nigga, town. my pops was coming to get us, so I was picking you up. Nigga, <laughs> fuck, we took up. Oh yeah, you related to like Joel Santana? Yeah, that's my uncle. 
Shout out Joel's. Hey. When, you have to understand, he probably always been an old head to you. When I was a fucking 18, 19 year old, Joel Santana might have been the coolest dude in the entire world to me. And his shirts were like a fucking 9X. <laughs> he was out here in a dress with a bandana on, and we thought he was the coolest fucking dude in the world. He's still cool. Don't get me wrong. We interviewed him a couple years ago. Nice. But when I was 18 or 19, he was the fucking man. Gangster. Gangster. What was your favorite song about? <laughs> that Santana anthem, whatever the fucking shit that started Cam's album. Nah, but then the, his I, whole I, project was fire. Postman. Yeah. That Postman? The Whistle song. <laughs> you still fuck a bitch off Postman. Yeah, Whistle song. That was you heard the Little Postman? Fresh song? All the mixtape joints the that I can't fresh, remember the names of and shit. Too. I mean, Wayne with the I Can't Feel My Face shit was going yeah, on. Was but that project that never came out. They but, just dropped like a few songs off of it. Oh, yeah, right? Yeah. So like you be getting advice and shit from him? Like with the music? Yeah, that's a fact. That's my boy. How hands on is he with shit? Like, uh, for me, I don't really be looking. For me, I be... Th for me, thugging in my own way, for me. Yeah. But that's my heart. If I ever need him, he going to be there for me, for sure. I uh -huh. be going to his crib, go to the studio, his crib and shit. Trying mm -hmm. to spend the night. That's really my family. Like, it don't really be on some music shit. It be on some, like, family shit. Because, like, before I was doing music, that's just my uncle. So it's like, mm. for me, word. But when you were a little kid, were you, like, really stoked on him? Or did you not really get it until you were a little bit older? Uh, like, yeah, I knew he was famous and shit. Like, but I ain't... I didn't really look at him how other people looked at him because it's like, that's my family and shit. Right. Like, it was just my uncle. Cool-ass uncle that a lot of people want to be their uncle. <laughs> so it was perks of him being your uncle and shit. Yeah. Like, bring of course you... it was lit. Yeah. What about the rest of the dip set and shit? Like, you was around any of them? Yeah. Cam, Jim, Gangsta. But more so Jim. That's the other one I'm really close with. I saw Uncasa. Where the man is. You, said, you, you ever think about doing a song with Jewels or any of those other dudes? Huh? Did you ever think about doing a song with them? Yeah, I got a song. Uh, with yeah. Them. Oh shit! Okay. It came out yet? <coughs> nah, nah, nah. It ain't come out yet though, right? But was it weird? Cause like you guys rap completely differently. Uh. You, uh even agreeing on a beat. Slow, it, wasn't, I gonna lie here. it wasn't weird. Even agreeing on a beat must have been weird. Nah, bro, got a feature that when y'all hit, I throw y'all niggas gonna be like, nah. Sexy yeah, red. Bloody? Yeah, nah, niggas can't even tell y'all. You saying that, bro? Nah, I mean, you, you, you were hanging out with that night. You playing with me, bro? I'm not playing with you. You playing with me, bro? Nah, you guys are. You guys got jokes. You guys are funny, so I gotta like <laughs> kind of fuck with you. You know? Nah, sexy might leave you school. Leave me? She might leave. You. Stop it. You guys seem like your you actual friends. Up. You like, might freeze up on the track. With like a lot. Sometimes you we interview groups like, that nah, they don't seem like they. See, they're in their own fucking world over here. Did you say school though? Yeah, school. We but, started that. School gang? <laughs> school. Nigga started that. That's all right, though. School. But you talking Scoob, the not church. Scoom, right? Nah, not Scoom. What's Scoom? Scoom is it's from Chicago. School, like, school. School. There's a big war in Chicago school. over who owns the rights to Scoom. Uh, Scoom gang. School. What about 6 now? I think it's Scoob gang. Scum gang. Oh, Scum gang. There you go. <laughs> Oh God! <laughs> <laughs> What's your relationship with like all uh, the New York rappers and shit? Like Fabio and everybody right now that's doing that shit. I did got a song with that nigga too. A oh, word. Yeah. Word too. What was that like? You you were in the studio with him? Or? At my uncle Joel's crib. Oh, for real? Facts. You feel like he's like the OG drill rapper in New York now at this point? Uh, he's a pioneer for sure. Pretty much. Mm. He like uh, inherited that shit. Yeah, what's up there? I ain't gonna lie. That's a what, fact. You, you still listen to Pop Smoke? You still hear his music in the city all the time? Yeah. Radio shit. What about pop, Bobby? Pop that nigga. Bobby. Pop, Bobby. Rowdy. Bobby. Rowdy. 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 Yeah. Mad I look at well. Bobby and Rowdy as like street nigga, like motivate. Like, they niggas, them niggas really like, like, they really show niggas like loyalty. Yeah, you get like, the mud, come like, back. Loyalty, bro. Still come back, it. still be with your niggas, go up with your niggas. Feel me? Go through struggle with your niggas, come home, be up with your niggas, word, yeah, real so. shit, bro. You gotta think about it. niggas almost counted those niggas out. Niggas is back, I ain't gonna lie. Official, that's official, that's how you do that. Mm. They popping, like, you feel like they popping, popping, like in New York? Yeah, for oh, sure. Man, they popping worldwide. Niggas, niggas is going up. Yeah. Pop I feel like they kind of lost popping. the wave a little bit. Like, you know, when it you do a long jam. bit, and yeah. Yeah, Bobby. So, yeah, I don't really listen, but you know, everybody. I mean, hot nigga, Bobby, bitch, songs like that, those always gonna be like, <laughs> for like, Bobby, bitch. Or, or you ain't, no. That's like, you see how our parents tell us about like Biggie and shit like that? Like, we gonna tell our kids about like 
niggas like that for me. <laughs> New York niggas for me. Wow. I gotta see what his numbers look like right now because people are always trying to count Bobby out because it's always like that though. Like when you when you get out, he ain't even dropped any music in a, in a while. He dropped a video called Rats a year ago that has a million views. But like people always kind of have like super high expectations for when people get out of jail, and sometimes it's just not really like that. Like sometimes nigga might want to get out of jail, and just live, spend some of that bread, nigga. Niggas been spending while he was in jail. Yeah, it's also just tough when you make music that's like aimed at a younger crowd, and so for him, it's like he's got to kind of find himself. Like he's not going to necessarily appeal to the eighteen-year-olds the way that like you guys will. They was fucking him up with the zesty rumors and shit. You know, like when he first came out, I think yeah, he was like whack. And whack, that. I was trying to talk he about that. Fucking him up with them. <laughs> <I mean, laughs> fucking him up. Niggas, <laughs> he was fucking him up with the zesty. I mean, rumors. yeah, that shit was just hurting his you career. You from New York? Where you from? I, I was born in New York. Nah, no, you right now. So I was born in Brooklyn. He was not. You're not a Brooklyn nigga, bro. I, I know how Brooklyn is. I was born in Flatbush. They don't bob with their hats like that. I moved down south type shit, but I was born in Brooklyn, long guy. You old at least. FedEx he, he didn't rock out, out of the pack. The FedEx he said, out the pack, man. He not playing with you. <laughs> this is like the first time he's ever <laughs> like, not won the fish hat. You always read the pack. I'll be wearing the Bass Pro joint. Over and over. I don't know what it is. It's like, it's part I of moved his, out, his I image. I was born in New York, but I moved down south. So, like, I spent like 10 years in Mississippi type shit. Oh, no. Nah. You in Mississippi? I ain't gonna lie, not yet. It ain't, it ain't. It's not lit. It ain't really. I mean, it's lit on some street shit, but like, ain't nothing to do out there. So, that's why I be. Nah, I know niggas getting money in Mississippi, bro. Nah. 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 <laughs> nah. It's barren. I mean, somebody nah, might. It's, it's dry. You know, it's some niggas getting money, but it ain't, it ain't too much to do out there. You feel me? New York niggas getting it's small. That chicken. Mississippi? Mississippi? Nah, it's, it's big, but it just ain't shit out there. So I like, spaced out. M I S S I S S I P P R. My niggas used to be like spelled Mississippi. Spell it backwards. I P P R. P P R S S I P P R. So who y'all fucking with on the music and shit like right now and shit? Like if y'all on y'all project and shit, if I could work with anybody, who would y'all want to work with? Right now we just Cause they say you got a crazy feature in the cut, but like yeah, who else yeah, outside I'm of trying, that? Man, I'm trying to work with everybody that's trying to work with me, man. Gangsta. I fuck with I fuck with mad I don't know, I fuck with mad rappers, bro. Word. That's like the go to answer though, cause like a lot of niggas I be asking that they don't never want to name drop, cause a nigga might not fuck with you. And then if you name dropping, then they ain't gonna get the feature type shit. But like, ain't nobody out there that you like. Nah, I gotta work with this person. Nah, I mean, I gotta work with me, Dirk, Lil Baby, all those niggas when I get bigger and shit. Yeah, I gotta work with that. You still I fucking think. with Meek, even after all the shit they saying. I don't really, you still fucking with Bobby? I fuck with Bobby. I fuck with, <laughs> <laughs> I fuck with Meek too, though. How y'all feel about the Meek Mill shit, though? You see, they dragging him. Nah, yeah. yeah I don't know. That's my son, bro. I'm jacking his music. I don't know about yeah, all that. Yeah, jack my son. Me. Meek's a legend. That's why people don't like seeing him carry himself in like weird ways on Twitter and shit. It's like it's just it's, it's like he should be better Lord, than me. that. He was really a gangster. Yo, come on, Deck. You're not doing that. But it, it it's got to be weird to have a very popular gay rumor about you. You know. What you mean? I, to be honest, I ain't gonna lie to you to see what, what, what happened. happened. Yeah, what happened? They were basically like accusing Meek of like fucking Diddy. Oh, shit. <laughs> I mean, that's what that's what it is. It came out. There was like a lawsuit that basically said that there was a Philadelphia rapper who dated Mickey, Nicki Minaj, who was like linked to some gay shit with Diddy. And then Meek basically like doesn't talk to his lawyer, doesn't talk to his his PR agent or whatever. He just goes on Twitter and he's like, "Hell no, I like pussy." And then <laughs> you know everybody just roasts him because it's like it's just. Like any, like you anything you could say right? about a gay rumor is gonna sound fucking weird because you're addressing it in the first place, right? Yeah. Like, but he should have said less. He should have just said like, "Nah, that shit kept." So what you say when they say Adam? You? Well, <laughs> but I mean, my image is different. Nah, I, I fuck around with it. Hey, I'm white. Yo. I got white boy humor. No. Wait, wait, what is you saying right now? I, I be saying gay bro. shit. You're it's funny. It up like, to right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, wait, you, you supposed to be on your what? bullshit. I mean, yeah, I, you what? guys don't fuck with how white boy humor. You never had a white friend who said some but, gay shit how you all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, you just saying like you just be playing with it. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, like, you're not I'm not gonna play with you guys because I can tell you guys are real like, like, shooters. Though, right? You it, guys bro. are giving off but shooter are you energy. Dead ass about the shit. You, why you keep avoiding that question? About what shit? The gay shit you. Why I'm not actually gay. But why actually, if you had a a little white friend that said gay shit though, I feel like a lot of people in New York. No, I went to school. I went to teen high, bro. You never had a little mob. 
taboo in your life? No, can I ain't gonna lie. Word to I my dad. I, I don't know how many white people I party about, with, bro. Like a white dude who had, makes gay jokes. My friend, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Around, but you've been around like, it. Yeah, okay. Like, like, Carl, that's my top white dude right there, bro. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, he'll probably like, make some gay jokes to his homie. My son No, he said no. Yo, Carl is Indian. Look at the hair. My son not white. Indian. What the fuck? That's my heart. Shout out to Carl. Shout out my nigga Carl. Shout out to Carl. But yo, you you you're not trying to work with Lil Mabu? Lil oh, Mabu, that's my boy. You fuck with him? Mabu, yeah. he be talking that shit. That's my boy, that nigga is a genius. Word too. I missed up. He's, he's, he's the king his, of New York. His New York drill. Uh, he, nah, you talked that shit. <laughs> king, king of New, of New York. York. To be honest, I didn't even know he was from New York. Nah, is Mabu, it? that nigga though. Mabu, one of those. Right? He 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 definitely Mabu one of from? those dudes. Huh? Where Mabu from? I'm not sure exactly, but I'm pretty sure he's from Manhattan. I think he goes to a college in Manhattan as well. What? Or at least he What college you go to Ma in Manhattan? Manhattan. Uh, I don't know. But I read like an article about him, I think, at one point that said that he was going to private high school in Manhattan. I don't know what he's doing, though. He's a funny hey, Mabu. That's, that's the guy. I'm so from Soho, man. Trop. Becca. I feel like he moved on from dissing other drill rappers to uh, like dissing fucking Blueface and shit like that now. He might diss you, man. Nah, we got solidarity. My boo, white boy, <laughs> shit. You My know? boo, small. He know how to get people attention, no matter what it tastes. You know, he know how to make people tune in. I ain't gonna lie. But he's not like culture vulture and drill rap. What you mean? Nah, uh, well, okay. He got OD talking shooter, like like he really talking around. He just it. yeah, like he talking shit, the shit about that he really was. Yeah. I jacked him because I, he played his role. Bro, yeah. Damn, like he don't try to act crazy on the net or nothing. He just making music and he good at it. You gonna press him for a feature? Press him? Nah. I don't, press him though. I don't have to press him. That's my boy. Tell him like give me a feature or you're not gonna be safe around here anymore. Nah, I don't no. Know. That's some weird shit. <laughs> Niggas not safe if they not attacking them with the guys. That's not that's some weird shit, bro. That's some hand shit. Okay. <laughs> Do you see yourself graduating past talking about all the street shit and yeah. like making like deeper music as time goes by? Yeah. Oh yeah. As niggas get older, bro, niggas gonna have more shit to talk about. Respect. But it'd be hard to get away from that after you kind of build your foundation on that, though, right? A little something, but the fans be wanting to see everything, bro. Yeah, I should just start mixing it in and out and shit more. It's gotta be hard to leave it alone when you got Kyle Rich and Tata and such and such running around the city talking shit, making songs about you. Those niggas. They supposed to be acting like Lil Malibu, bro. They supposed to be just rapping. They talking about niggas. When niggas see niggas. They're going too crazy with it? Bro, they mans got stripped butt-ass niggas. They kidnapped, bro. They kidnapped. <laughs> they do shit them. for them, bro. bro. Nigga ja they mans Ja Wu. Oh. They niggas kidnapped got, them. Niggas kidnapped them and stripped them butt-ass niggas. On live. On live, you ain't. And they ain't do shit for him, bro, but rap about, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, where's Shiki at? Why he ain't reverse the V on, on the niggas that did that? <laughs> Y'all fuck with Paparazzi Poe? He said he kind of, like, started the drill shit in New York. I <laughs> ripped that nigga, bro. Niggas gonna catch that nigga and do something to him. You don't like him? Nah, niggas gonna chat that. But he's like an old head, dude. He, he like, yeah, like, and His pops old. a riot. <laughs> yeah, but he knows that. I'll pull a riot. Nigga, dad. That's Lil Poe. That's a little Alpo. Nah, pop. Nigga niggas in the streets be saying I point paparazzi pose that one of those niggas. I heard that a couple times. That he was? That he yeah, was? I heard back then that he was one of those niggas. Oh, you heard that he was a mouse? Mouse? You heard that? Yeah. Paparazzi Poe? <laughs> a, baby, a baby rat? Nah, he was saying that he was on some crazy shit, right? Nah, he might have been, though. I ain't gonna lie. Bro, it's the streets, bro. New York began to live, bro. He told me after he did his interview that Billionaire Black got his YouTube channel deleted. Who that? Right. Billionaire wow. Black. Is he dissed GD him? from Chicago. He dissed him? Yeah, he was definitely going off on him. He got his YouTube him. deleted? Yeah, that's the new way of doing Paparazzi battle. Paparazzi pulled GDK? Uh, he was definitely dropping rakes on this podcast. Yeah, he was heavy on it. Heavy. Dropping rakes? He was slamming him. He kept saying, I'm slamming him. I'm not dropping him. I'm slamming him. Slamming him. I was like, wow, that's, that's But he lot. be hanging out with GDs, though. Niggas be doing anything, bro. I told you, bro. I learned from them that if you if you say you're GDK, then you fanned out. Now I'm just calling everything fanned out. Anything anyone says to me, shit, fanned bro. out. Yeah, niggas be fanned four out. Four one, fanned out. <laughs> All jokes aside, bro. They're fanned out. Fanned out, bro. Niggas not even in the streets, bro. 
I, that's what's really like niggas be having to stop, bro. How that beef even start? Like I just they were dissing. Fucking my little man, that's YouTube. I just bro. told you the block work and all that. Like, uh, sure. That shit is YouTube shit, bro. We not gonna bump into them niggas nowhere, but like places like this, rolling loud airports. You know the street, bro. But Tell I feel you. like the YouTubers are lacking because there's not like good enough documentaries about you guys yet at this point. And normally they got videos about everything, but I, I feel like they need like more in depth breakdown of you guys' crimes and shit. Crimes. <laughs> Anything you got arrested for, like break on, down all that. Anybody you ever dissed in songs. You know, you make like a nice twenty minute video. I'll watch it. Mm-hmm. You watch it. I'll like button it. <laughs> I seen like any of the Trout Lloyd Ross shit. Trout Lloyd Ross got like two New York documentaries. I think he did. Yeah, I yeah. seen any of that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It'd be mad. It'd be mad. Little um interviews and shit though. That I mean not interviews. Little documentaries with the robot you know voice. No, a New York nigga that I really that I really jack, bro. That really he don't even rap with on Kosh or that, bro. Kosh. Yeah, games. Yeah, he don't get the credit that for nigga being like the bro, most too. successful younger dude out that in New York. Nigga, that nigga dead inspiration, bro. I dad used to watch that nigga video yeah, when he was in his crib, crib bro. I call Phantom Heavy. Phantom 2, or mm-hmm. I thought you were going to say uh, BMG Upper Class. BMG? Shout, nah, fuck BMG. shout out my son Crooklyn. BMG. Word. There's a lot of up and coming talent. But I'm more closer to my son space. Crooklyn. Okay. But I know BMG and shit too. What about Swayze? Swayze, Swayze oh, I who is Swayze? That's, you know that is? That's from Uncle Brooklyn. Swayze, he, man. Wait, um, he showed who his face is? No, shit? no, no. Oh, he just like it. Y'all think that's really his voice? Yeah, I think he just throws some sauce on it. trolling, bro. I'm telling you, bro. I know people, boy, they be trolling. <laughs> Nigga, Swayze. Little voice Yo, monitor talking. Look like? Fuck it. Okay, close your eyes. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, close your eyes and think about Hell Swayze. No. Think when you about picture Swayze. Swayze, you picture a black dude, right? Wow. I don't know. I, I, it give me makes emotion, bro. Uncle to Swayze. me, he give me mixed, like, like, you know, no, I know why you said it because he was like Uncle Swayze and shit. Like, but he um, give me weird black dude vibes. Like <laughs> black dude be like, Uncle. He like, got to be mixed with something else, gang. That's weird. That he do like he not variety is the spice of life. It's like his. <laughs> I think it's just for varieties. I think it's life. for um, the bar, entertainment, the but it's like, like that nigga just be. It's, I don't understand. Why, like, nah, he be sweet. saying some. But bro, I, I dad be, be saying some funny shit. Yeah, bro. I dad be watching that shit though. Word too. It's right. Crazy. Can't you, you respect famous Richard? Yeah, he be doing some funny um, shit. On um, BD. On um, BD. On um, BD. Nah, yeah. yeah. I remember he, he was came on the to the block with us. Two, he was pr- he was on his body. He was on his body. He was right. in, the, in the video and shit. You got him yeah. in there just chilling. Yeah, we yeah. was on his body. We did a stick. We was playing with him. We was playing with him like, yo, suck. Yeah, we did a skit. We did a skit shit with him. We was playing with him like, yo, what's up? What's Bob's game? I seen him on the interview. Him and Crip Mac, they was really going to get it, though. It was looking Nah, nah, I ain't gonna lie. Bro, what am I dead? That security hat was a bozo nigga, bro. Oh, man, he was just calling the guy the security. It was just his, like, was his oh, friend his slash friend manager. Yeah, yeah, the white guy. Like, I got friends I call my security. Yeah, that's yeah, why I was so funny, because he's just calling him the security. That is somebody. The nigga we did the interview. Yeah. When the nigga said, are you retarded? Nigga had the, yeah, nigga had the mask. You got interviewed by Famous Richard Security? No, I'm talking about the guy he was about to him leave his... Yeah, his, his shop outside. The guy, yeah. What a fucking ass. Oh, you was about to fight, ass. Oh, about to fight Famous Richard, Fuck, right? Niggas be getting stripped butt naked in Cali, bro. You're the one who got on the plane and got here and you don't even got yeah, a strap. They just, start, they just searched us. <laughs> <laughs> yo, 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 you it's heard like me though, buddy? Ghetto. Who you guys going to tap in with? What gang? I'm going to put you in touch. Cali? Yes. What's up with the Hoovers? I heard them niggas is on that. Yeah, I fuck with Where the Hoovers at? No comment. Niggas don't fuck with the Hoovers? <laughs> I'm going to tap you in with a big deal. Who that? That's a big Hoover. He's a big deal. He yeah. big Hoover. Hoover. One of the biggest. Deuce. As far as I know. Shout out my nigga OG Bobby Johnson, you heard? Really? Word. He said, nah, yo. You stupid. I remember that movie, though. Gangster. Y'all, I mean, be, t- y'all be tapping in with niggas when y'all come out here and shit? Like, how y'all nah, feel about you? Nah, niggas be like, I'm mm-hmm. trolling, though. I don't want no involvement with none of that mm-hmm. douche shit, none of that Cali shit work. I doubt Big <laughs> Deal. Big Deal probably has no idea that there's people saying that they're Hoover in New York. Nah, you probably not, never nah, even Hoover, thought about it. It's not Hoover in New York. There we isn't? Just, I thought there was. Nah, nah it is Hoover in New York. Word too. When I was in the spot, it's dead of stopped. That nigga was Hoover. He got it tied again. Nah, certain niggas is Hoover, I guess. But I'm talking about like Hoover blocks, as in like it's Jet Blocks, Mac Blocks. Yeah. No. It's not blocks you go to me like niggas yeah. is like, nah, we all Hoover. Nah, nah, yeah. nah. I don't know. You consider China Mac an official blood? China Mac. 
Yeah, he, he a fish boy, I guess. Who that? I like how you don't pay attention to shit, and he's super tapped in. Yeah, I keep know. naming people, and you know right away, and he's like, "What?" Yeah, I don't be, I don't be worried. All right, all right. What about uh, K. Flog? You think that was a huge blow to the drill scene when he got taken off the streets? Take what? Well, he locked him up. <laughs> I thought he was gonna say when he started rapping. Like, what no, you mean? What, what, no, what I'm you saying mean? I did, you it was like a hurt. blow to the streets. Like it was a bad thing. Bad thing, like like when he got arrested for shooting and killing someone outside a barbershop. Uh, free him, free him, free him. That's what my only comment I got on that. Free that nigga. Or free that nigga. It might have. Oh yeah. Um, yeah, free him. Yeah, free K. Fly. Y'all, 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 y'all don't really fold him. Uh, free that nigga. That's it. That's all I gotta say about that. Free everybody else in jail, man. Or free everybody. Yeah. Mm. Fuck the rapists. The guys. But who? Fuck the Ravens? <laughs> he said the rapists. The rapists? I said free everybody out of jail. Oh, oh, oh. oh. I, I thought you were talking about like Edgar Allan Poe type shit. Um, so yeah, you, guys, you guys don't fuck with the sweepers? We don't fuck with nobody, bro. Yeah, really? Yeah, you we guys are isolationists. We the in the city, nigga. That's what I'm trying to tell you. That's the vibe that you guys are trying to bring? That's not the vibe. That's what it is, bro. The vibe chose us. I don't know, niggas just don't be... I don't know. Is it like niggas clicked up type shit or it just it is what yeah, it is? Niggas be clicking up against us. Fuck it. We love that shit. We give niggas the belt. Yeah. So like Harlem and shit, y'all be sticking together? So is it, like how, how what's what's the what's the vibe like? No, like Harlem don't jack us. What? Shit crazy. Why are you guys out here well, it was you doing a song with Sugar Hill Glitch who's like seven years yeah, he's old he's bugging I told him about that <laughs> Shut up, I bro. don't I'm promote trying, that bro. I'm telling the world like him, I trying, don't bro. promote Sugar Hill Glitch raps no I told him the other day I saw him on the blog I told him bro what you tell he him need to go to school uh, no he was going to school I told him bro <laughs> stop I told him stop he said no he was going he was to school he was on the way to school I told him bro stop dissing niggas bro Cause now we're too The wrong niggas See him not playing About they dead homies bro She could go left bro Man. Oh for sure like, yeah. And I dead Jack that, That's dead my little bro I mean he too. should not be Walking around on some Regular shit Like he's nah, probably he's dead, Hot bro. topic he on re- his He's ops. a regular kid Yeah, yeah bro He, he be outside on the block With his with his pops and shit chilling. Yeah. Bro, that is and that's crazy. It. What is well, he wrong just with his parents? Though. What you mean, nigga? What the shit? fuck? Nigga, everybody be outside. Yeah, 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 yeah but he's like he's six. He's like after school. He's not I'm six. I'm saying if right. I had he's a kid like, like that, I'm not like letting nine. him rap about yeah. smoking he's on all like these people. third grade, bro. Yeah, he's third like, grade. Well, we're acting like that's like kind of close to an adult. No, we're not saying he's outside on the block with us. We're saying like he be outside. Like the front of his building where other little kids is age and shit. That's what I'm saying. I know. I'm saying that's a problem. You can't be rapping like that and just standing on the stoop. No, yeah, the rapping part, he's not with that, with the shit, no, he could how rap. Many people rap and be outside shit, in the, the project. Yeah, but most though. of them aren't. Seven. How many rap and be outside the project? What the fuck? Most of them be like twenty. That's what I'm saying. At least at twenty, you could plausibly take care of yourself. When you're seven, what are you gonna do? Yeah, call Kambasi. That's glitch. <laughs> yeah, bro, I dad care about my son, bro. I told him, bro, stop doing that, bro. It's mad stuff you could talk about in your music. Talk about the girls and school. Nah, me, bro, I just don't shit, care bro. because, bro. It's money be made, bro. Niggas gonna get that bread, bro. Go get it, bro. First uh, niggas not gonna be little kids no more, bro. Niggas gonna come outside and do shit niggas was doing. But they kill little kids, too. <laughs> like, maybe not that little on bro, all the time. Little kids by you don't hear purpose, about, like, bro. targeted hits on seven-year-olds that often, but I feel like that for sure they would make an exception for him. Oh, yeah. What? Yo, Adam, bro, stop. I mean, bro, with, the, with all the shit he's saying in his songs you, and shit. Nigga. No, I'm, I'm good. I'm chilling. The niggas making a stretcher for you, bro. Nah. No, nah. Nigga gonna make I'm it. good. You good. You got bro out there skied up. Niggas are do something to that nigga. He Lock can hear me, call. too. Lock Lock that niggas are do something to you. Brody with the scheme ass word. What? Word. <laughs> shit like that, you heard? Nah, Brody good. Word. <laughs> Word. Good. I told that nigga, but don't check my man right bro. now. I know oh, twin. I him. know twin out there. Look at him up and down right now. My son boogie man, right? Some man. Uh, Shit could go left real <laughs> fast. You're a ski mask man. Word. <laughs> <laughs> Word. Oh, no. Oh no. Um. Okay, but nah, I'm fucking with you, ski mask man. <laughs> <laughs> but what what is the relationship with like D Dot and all these other Sugar Hill rappers? Baby boys, that's the slums. They about to pull up out here too. Those are your only non-ops in the city? 
Nah, those niggas from, from the block. That's you know what I'm saying. They're from the same neighborhood. But they've always been supportive of you guys rapping and shit, and it's yeah, never bro, got weird. Don't fuck too. with niggas like that in New York, but we fuck on. I, I be fucking my son like BBG. Yeah, I fuck with my son. Fuck my, my son. Why be she do? Okay. Yeah, we fuck with the OT niggas. <laughs> For sure. Um, but I got friends in Harlem. Don't get it confused. Okay. I got friends in Harlem, like from certain places, but like it's not really a whole block we cool with. Like even my friends in Harlem, I ha- they'll be my friends, but niggas from their block, we yeah. still like we don't fuck with them. Like, but they just like niggas I grew up with, shit like that for me. Mm-hmm. Or, got it. <laughs> Y'all out here rolling loud and shit though too, though, right? This gonna be our first rolling loud performance, huh? This gonna be our first like rolling loud. Nah, we, well, his first might be my first one. My second though. Okay. Who went viral? Remember they was dancing? I think it was one of K-Fly homies. Remember the nigga was dancing on stage? Oh, yeah. yeah. He looked he like went. he was off a pill or something. That's like, a druggy oh. beat. Druggy beat. <laughs> <laughs> you guys be doing drugs? What? You be doing drugs? You see what nah. you doing? Nah. Right I smoke weed. You sniff that coke? You guys perk <laughs> <laughs> I used to. Nah. So I can tell you everything you need to know about it. Keep it a buck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, so how you cut your that coke? That shit give you a rush? I, I don't cut my own <laughs> coke. What the <laughs> fuck are you talking you about? I'm not, I'm not a salesman. Yo, how that shit get you hot? That shit just rush your mouth out of it. No, that shit rocks your <laughs> fucking <laughs> mouth out of it. You know the way that it feels snorting a line of coke? You feel like your whole brain is just... <laughs> Like, you, how does it get you hard or like? What are you just, talking like, about? What makes you, you do, like it though, gang? You used like, to do of coke? So like, you never did a drug that like got you up? You never took a molly or none? No. Uh, the most drug I ever did that got me up, pop, nah, I was like you an need to smoke meth. E, like, Yeah, yeah. Picture like a, a very extreme you addy. Before? You did everything. Uh, I never smoked meth, meth but I crazy. took meth. You took, you did Yo, everything. you heavy. I hate that I never tried PCP. You tried the pipe? I want to try PCP. I had some friends who lost it. Nah, nah, nah. You could try acid. Years of that shit. You want to try acid, yeah. Oh, yeah. You want to, what the fuck? Is acid. acid? What is tab. that? LSD. It's like a tab. Like a tab shit. That shit burn your tongue. That shit have you questioning yeah. everything. Questioning everything. What you mean? Acid like, tab. Pause. 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 Hey, yo, <laughs> what? We he said, yo. He said he a crush you. Yo. You know, yo. <laughs> hey, yo. What's up? Hey, hey, he's crushing said. the homie. Niggas what not, the fuck? Nigga said, yo. The nigga said, yo. Acid. I have you questioning things. Pause, pause, pause. Question or question? What? Well, I just saw it in your eyes that you thought that I was trying to say some gay shit. Nah, you, you tried to question him, my man. Nah, you scaring me, Adam. I ain't gonna lie, Adam. You tried to question you. You want some weight? Why you turning your head like that, bro? I'm looking at the pussy water. Let me get a set, bro. Back Let me get some pussy water. I don't think you want to Oh, that's that. where M.R.O. got Back the pussy that water from? out, bro. It's got vagina sauce yeah. in it. Um, that's really a store? It's called pussy water? I don't know the whole story. I haven't bro, seen the episode yet. That's so. not pussy water. Song. Somebody broke it out. That's not pussy water. We broke it out. That's Some, not somebody pussy came water, on the podcast that's and presented us a bottle water, of their bro. pussy juice. That's not pussy juice. Wait, who's, bro. wait, who pussy water is that though? Some woman. I don't know. If, if somebody got that much pussy juice to give you in a bottle, yeah. that shit is piss game. That's that water. <laughs> You're drinking nah, piss. Basically, she just let the faucet run down her shit. And she oh, yeah. Just just bro, you know what? I actually the, watched the them do a fucking 20 versus one. I never actually watched one of those before. <laughs> I see them advertised to me on YouTube all the time. I never actually watched well, one. I didn't do 20 versus one. This shit might go up. I ain't gonna lie. I thought about it, but it's like it played out. Do. Everybody done it now. I say, like, you though. I'm talking about you, 20 versus you. 20 bitches? 20 bitches. I'm telling them, I'll fuck off. I'm a married man. Leave me alone. Who y'all did the 20 versus one with? Where y'all did it at? We did it with Naughty. 20 <laughs> versus me, him, and Roscoe. They asked the first, the first chick, they're like, how many dudes you fucked in the last year? And then you hear another girl yell in the background, like, oh, you better not ask me no shit like that. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> it's awkward as fuck. The girls are just coming up. Actually, I fucked with the second girl. The first girl, her booty was a little lumpy. I wasn't really fucking with that. But <laughs> shout out to her, though. <laughs> Yo, Blade, what you got tatted right there on your uh, face, man? I got my grandmother name tatted on my face, huh? Tight People shit. ever confuse you with Bloody Osiris? Nah. Oh. He's from the city too, right? No. Nah. No? I thought he was from oh, New York. It, yeah. Oh, was he? <laughs> he's like a fashion dude, though. He don't rap. Nah, I didn't know if he was from New York. I could have swore he was from Harlem. I think he's from New York, yeah. All right. Appreciate you guys coming in. I will Fuck see Adam. you. I'll see you at Rolling Loud. I'm not an op. Yo, this nigga's <laughs> a mook, yo. I'm pulling up to Sugar Hill. No, you're not. Yes, I am. Can I? Yeah. yeah you guys will show me around? Yeah, hey, we're going to do a vlog. We're going to do a vlog. We're going to do a vlog. Back at the chopsticks in the car. Say, 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 duty low and bloody. Can I please come to Sugar Hill? <laughs> right no, now, bro. But 
Ugh. Stop pointing that thing at it. But uh, hey, yo, he said stop pointing. But you gotta that make sure you gotta make sure all the cocoa felons are outside. I got, I got you. you. All right, glitch, go. glitch is gonna be on you. Oh. Glitch gonna be on you. Word. I can lie, bro. He heard what you said about him. And I'm gonna make a bad, bad boy. He's bad nigga, but he's gonna try right. to pop on you. He gonna pop on you. Jump, <laughs> jump in the air and hit you. I'm bringing yeah, extra true. security to keep right, sugar hill glitch away from me. That's what they go. Ski mask, man. You no good on the block. Glitch gonna turn me into a bacon egg and cheese. You cannot bring ski mask to the bank. Niggas, man, who that? Who that? Because the way he moving, bro. He's moving dust to Juan, nigga, to get That's all LA this. security. He knows what's going on yeah, out here. You don't know is. about all your local bodega politics. Nah, nah what, what nigga left in bodega? Don't like do that. that. Nigga get left. Word. Multiple niggas died in bodega. Well, sure, sure. Bodega windows drop. Yo, we going to end this shit right sure, here. Sure, yo, sure, sure. Yo, next <laughs> yo, yo, <laughs> next yeah, interview. Y'all together? Yo, look, yo, look, I'm a rapper. Yo, look. I'm a rapper. How about this? How about this? Let's make a deal. Next interview we do going to be on our block outside. Let's go. Outside. I'm in New York for a week during 420. On I well, and that's my birthday. 420 my birthday. And we be getting high. All right, we going hot. We going hot. Right, we going hot. We going hot. Blow out. Bloody. Yeah. Yo. New York. Stand up. Hey, yo, blow that shit. New York that drill official. Guys, Repost beep, this. Beep. Shout out my man, Remo. No Jumper. Coolest podcast in the world. Check us out on YouTube, TikTok, Patreon, Instagram, etc. Like, comment, and subscribe. Nojumper.com if you want to support. Bow.